and welcome back to Let's Play Wario Land. In the last episode, the top dropped onto the top of Mount Teapot. That's a lot of alliteration. But let's see what the skull looks like. This is course number 13. We cannot go back to course number... What was it before? Course 10? So, but as you can see, it looks very similar to course 10. It just looks like it's been crushed. Appropriate enough. It is much harder now because there's much less area to maneuver, and especially with the water down here. As you can see, these sections originally had two layers of water or three layers to go in, and I can't get up there without the jet hat. And down here, we can't get in there anymore because that's all been crushed, to, crushed down been compressed. So we can get that easier. We can get the heart. What's this? The or another heart right there. And another heart, essentially. I, am, I keep riding on that thing. Oh yeah, you can also kill enemies by picking them up and then using a ladder. Because you can't hold enemies on a ladder. For some reason. Pick this guy up. I'll try to pick him up. And then just use the ladder. If I can... Ah, eh, screw it. I wanted to show it to you, but oh well. What's in here? This is a checkpoint, isn't it? I might as well use it. Get the fire out of the way, Wario. Let's use this. And I think I'm going to need the bull hat against this guy. There's the garlic. Let's grab ourselves a bull hat. And we can't go anywhere from here. If we try to go down, we'll just uh, reach a dead end. As you can see, there's nothing here. Just a heart. Fine with the ladder, Wario. Now I can show it to you. Oh, damn it. Well, you saw it before. Just roll the video back if you missed it. Down we go, because it's faster than taking the ladder. And we hit on into... Oh, crap. Alright, you can take these multiple sections. And we have to take this one. There's a heart here, and I believe this one is a... Jet hat. And this one is a heart. I'm going to keep the bull hat for now, because I want it against the boss. Don't let that touch you, because that ins that's instant death lava down there. And here we are against the bull enemy. Just run into him and toss him into the lava. And that's it. Simple as it gets. Yeah, probably the easiest boss in the game. The ones guys I don't like are the turtle in level 1. I missed three points. No biggie. 175. I probably should have shown off the level three hearts hearts round, but no biggie. No biggie. And we get up to 15, 5, 15, 50. Awesome. And Wario claims Mount Teapot as his own as well. Because he's a white man. He likes to claim things. And finally, we move on to Stove Canyon. But... I'm not in the mood for something hot. I'm on the I'm in the mood for something cool. After my tea, I like dessert. So let's head over to Sherbet Land. Level one of Sherbet Land. Course number 14. You're intended to do this after Mount Teapot, which is why if you go to Stove Canyon, it'll be called like level uh, 18 or something. Possibly level 19, I think. Depends on how many levels are in Sherbet Land. I don't know exactly how many. I do know that this entire section is optional. Because there are pretty tough levels here. A lot of them are in the sky or in the ice. Whoa, careful. I really should have brought the jet hat for this one. I don't like jumping on these breaking bridges. Or around those mosquito birds. Damn finches. Throw that at you. And there's a checkpoint here. 
and we can still get the dragon hat. I think I'll get the dragon hat. It's better in the air. Wait for it. And jump out. There we go. No! Take the jump, Mario. There we go. What's in here? More hearts. This can drop us down. Wait, make the... Where the hell are we? Where the hell are we? I want... I want to go down. Okay. And it's a heart. That was completely pointless, Wario. You got a 1-up from it, but you would have gotten a 1-up from any heart. You're at 99. No! Oh, whoa! That was a close one. Another close one. Could ride those down to get those coins, but I'm not gonna do that because that would be suicidal. That damn bird there. What's in this box? Garlic! Just what I needed. I hate being small Wario, he's completely defenseless. And here's a new enemy, a buckethead! Another large enemy. You wanna pick him up and throw him into the spikes. Thankfully, they don't require you to pick up 10 coins there. Fifteen seventy nine, not bad. Could have done better though, but I do not like that level. I like levels that have flat land, like this one. Ooh, this is a maze level. Oh, run into each other. And I just tossed him into the ceiling. No. Can I make it down? Oh, careful. Okay. Wario has a Mr. T haircut. There's a Mr. T mohawk. That's pretty cool. Yeah, the little gooms are completely helpless. They can't hurt you at all. Ooh, jet hat. Awesome. And there we... I just took out a porcupine. Those guys can be pretty annoying. I can show you it to them. If you jump on them, it doesn't do anything. It causes them to shoot their spikes out. They will also walk up to you and do that shit, and I thought I could avoid them in time, but I couldn't. Damn it. I take him out with another. No. Pick him up. Throw him. There we go. Damn it, I want those treasures. I want those eye blocks. Yeah, little gooms can do nothing. They can run right into you and do nothing to you. It's, it's a dragon hat. Awesome. Yeah, you can't free these guys from the ice, unfortunately. Or, maybe hey, fortunately, I guess. Eh, I like how they have their eyes all opened up and bugged out. Oh, there's a swamp. I should have been using him for special stuff. Oh my. There's a checkpoint. I'm not gonna need it. I have save states. Okay, and right here, we have secrets, and there's garlic, I do not want, damn it, oh well. One sec. Okay. And there's stuff here that we can't get. But how do we get rid of these weird blocks? We can't bash into them, we can't butt stomp them, we can kill the other enemies around them though. Jump up through here and hit this switch. Destroy these blocks because I'm OCD like that. Stop ripping off other better Let's Players, TZ. Whoa, that was close. Whoa, careful. This boomerang returned to nothing. Now we could open up the exit here and finish the level, or we could head back to where we started and find the that these stairs have appeared. Yes. Another secret section. This is why I like Sherbet Land so much. All the secrets in it. Out of the way. Ah, crap, no. Bucky. 
dumbass. You damn beaver tooth piece of crap. Wow, I can't see anything here. I need to hit another switch. There's another one. Awesome. Okay. Now we have land here. We can open the secret exit after we get all these coins. Ugh, you're so slow, small Wario. Heart. Heart. And we... And we get out of level four, 15, I think it is. Let's tally up our total for the end of the episode. But what further secrets await us in Sherbet Land? Find out next time on Let's Play Wario Land as I rip off H.C. Bailey even more. Later, folks.